guys, it is Tuesday morning now. We are on our road trip. We went to a movie at the um, theater this morning and saw Trolls during the summer. I think I mentioned it earlier. They do dollar movies of movies that's already played through the year. Yeah. So this week was Trolls. Did you like it? Pretty good? I think it may have been a little bit too kitty or girly for you. Is that what it was? A lot of singing and dancing. It was super cute. And now we are on our way to a town about an hour and 15 minutes from us. We just stopped to actually have lunch. It was time for us to eat and I packed our lunch. I did pan seared chicken strips and those keto um, Tremonthi Mama S buns that I have a video for. I'll put the link down below so you can see that recipe video. And they were delicious. I used the Hot Logic. I showed you some footage of that last night as I was getting ready. We plugged it in. It was plugged in for about two hours. Um, after we went to the movie, we plugged it in, run a couple errands, and then drove here. So about two hours, I think. And it was warm. The buns were warm. The chicken was warm. And we added tomato and onion and mayo, Duke's mayo. And they were delicious and very filling. So we had a hot lunch, and we didn't break the bank or the budget, and we stayed on plan and eat a healthy lunch. So that was delicious. And now we're going on an exciting trip for me. We're going on to our discount, my favorite discount grocery store, and then to Aldi. And I never get to go to those two, so I'm super excited, and I hope to show you some of the stuff while we're there. To see what all I got in there, I got $62, and I'm going to show you all the food I got later, but oh my goodness, I got the mom chills. I found so much food, in date, great looking food for great prices. I can't wait to show them. Now we're headed to Aldi. Okay, we are out of Aldi's and we scored another great haul in there. We spent just a little over $92. So, $92 at Aldi and about $62 and some change at the discount grocery store. Um, my budget was $220. So, I have, I think I roughly have $50 something dollars left. I hadn't checked to make sure. And with that, I need to grab some ground beef and uh, pork loins and things like that, but I'll get that uh, later. We're kind of both tired. He's tired, mom's tired, dad's tired. Mm -hmm. You're not tired? You're not? Earlier you were saying you were ready to go. Yeah, but I oh, your feet were hurting all these? He just didn't want to stay. So now we are loaded up, and I mean the vehicle's loaded to the max. And dad had to run in the convenience store. He's gonna get us some ice, we all need some water. We're having snack time and then we're headed out for the hour and 20 minute ride home we got everything done and i'm looking forward to showing you guys all the bargains but honestly i'm not looking forward to unloading the car and putting everything away because that is my least favorite thing so i'll see you when we get home and get everything unloaded and i'll show you what we got all right you guys we have made it back home and i'm going to go over the haul this is not all of it i have some back here too so let me get started so we're not here all night long and I'm holding you guys up. Um, in our dairy section, <laughs> our dairy section. Now keep in mind, I am shopping for three to four weeks. So this is a big monthly haul and um, I set a budget of $220 for the three to four weeks. We are under budget so the remaining I will use to grab some ground beef at the end and fresh veggies towards the uh, end of the weeks. Okay, for dairy, they had, this is from Aldi. All the dairy is from Aldi. They had their cream cheese for 79 cents a block. So I got four of those. The whole milk that my son drinks um, for $2.17, I believe. Their heavy cream was $1.68 and their half and half was $1.79. So I got three of those. Now keep in mind, we will not drink all this um, half and half and heavy cream in a week that'll last us probably three to four weeks closer to four then we got almond milk now we do drink one of these a week because we drink shakes and then we have it on our granola cereal it's the um aldi brand and it's unsweetened they had, guys they had that for a dollar 99 so i was super excited ours around here that i normally get is 2.89 or 2.99 so i was super excited I got two blocks of mozzarella cheese, a block of mild cheddar, some string cheese, and then I got two, four, eight dozen eggs. Now, this is the first time I've been able to find eggs as cheap as everybody else. On YouTube, I see people talking about eggs all the time for, like, dirt cheap. But ours are always the cheapest I ever find them around here. Lately, they've been 79 cents, but Aldi's had them for 49 cents, so I got eight dozen. 
eight dozen. We go through probably two dozen a, with the three of us, two dozen a week. But I bake for other people, and we eat muffin cups a lot, and and sometimes we have breakfast for dinner. So this should last us probably four weeks. So and they're all dated until well into August. So we should have time to do that with, without them going bad. And then they had their garden salad mixes, which I don't like it that it has a little bit of carrot in it, but I can pick that out um, or eat it. It's not very much in there, but I just don't like carrots in my salad. This was 89 cents a bag, so I got three of those. We're going to have a lot of salads this week. They had a bag of sweet potatoes, and it's a three-pound bag for $1.49. I picked those up. My son loves them, and when I have e-meals and higher carb meals, I eat one of those. This is one thing I'm also super excited about. These are nice size um, cauliflower heads, and if you guys know anything or eat a lot of cauliflower, you know this can be so expensive. Guys, I'm not joking. At Kroger and our grocery stores around here, I refuse to buy it because it's been $4 a head. This size, $4. That's, this is simply crazy to me. But I was tickled to death because Aldi had them for a dollar. 59 I believe or 49 I should have got my receipts but I don't have them anyway $1.59 I'll say that and I got three heads of that I got celery um from Aldi yeah for a dollar I want to say it was a dollar 19 a dollar 29 I got this because I'm gonna have the Trim Healthy Mama has a recipe called the wardrobe or wardrobe I can't even say it don't even laugh or laugh at me because I'm laughing at myself salad I saw Claire um, hi Claire, if you're watching, hello, over at Cookie Crumb Fun. She's been having that salad for lunch and stuff, and it looks so good. And she reminded me about that when I watched her video, so I'm going to try it. i got some apples in the fridge, and I'll show you the walnuts I picked up later. Um, we've got dog food at Aldi. We have two inside puppies. At Walmart, I normally get it for $0.79. Cents. Aldi had it for $0.69, cents. so I grabbed eight of those. Um, back here, let's see. I should have separated out, guys, by stores, but I didn't, so I'll tell you what I got each one. Up here, we got 48 of these um, Aqua Ball su Zero Sugar Fruit Punch. Basically, it's just naturally flavored water drink, and I want to show you if it'll focus. It probably will not. Oh, I don't even know where it's at. Can you see that? Stevia, citric acid, water, and then vitamins. You guys... So, my son likes them. They have a little cute Disney. There's Minnie, there's Mickey, and Donald Duck. You guys, there's 24 in a case, and we got this at our discount grocery store, $1.49 per 24. So, we got this basically $3 for 48 of those, and they taste pretty good. So, I thought he would love those. That'll last a while. We all love them, so who knows? Maybe it'll last us a couple of weeks at least with all three of us drinking, if not more. So, we got that at the discount grocery store. And then all this meat, I'm about to show you. We got at the discount grocery store, too. That's my light here because I have horrible lighting in the kitchen, you guys. Mo this is mostly chicken breasts, and there is some boneless skin with chicken thighs. But let me show you how much they were. 79 cents a pound for Ty Tyson All Natural Fresh. Which Tyson, I don't know if you guys know, but Tyson is huge in Arkansas. We have Tyson plants everywhere, so... But it's usually kind of an extensive name brand, so I was glad to get that for 79 cents a pound. I got these four-pound family packs of boneless, skinless breasts for $4.99. I thought that was amazing. That's like a dollar a pound or a little bit more. Uh, $1.25, I guess. So I got two bags of those. This is more chicken breast strips like we had today in our lunch. And it's nature raised. There's no antibiotics. Uh, they're vegetarian fed. The chickens are cage free. No added hormones or steroids. And look how much they were. Dollar. Uh, there you go. 79 cents a pound. So I got four packages of those, which I thought was awesome. I got also that same brand. I got chicken thighs, boneless, skinless chicken thighs, which is crazy because thighs I thought were cheaper. But you know, lately the boneless, skinless thighs are as much as breast meat. But Anyway, you can see I got that also for 79 cents a pound. So I got two of those. I kind of wish I had to got more of those because my husband likes if it'll focus. Sorry, guys. I'm not going to focus back. I may have too much video in here. Hopefully I won't. Oh, come on. There we go. All right. Sorry about that. I don't want to start over, so I apologize. I got these. Eight three ounce burger patties for two ninety nine guys, and there's nothing in there but let's see if it'll focus. 
anyway, it's not going to, but beef. And then I saw these Butterball Everyday Turkey Burgers. There are 12 in a box, and they were, can you see that? You may not can. $3.99 for 12 of those. So I thought I would try those. Okay, and some more things. Now these are um, two of my favorite things to get at Aldi. Or, um, actually, my favorite thing, one of them. 85% dark chocolate from Aldi's. These were $2.19, which the last time I got them, they were $1.89, I think. But it's been... Oh, I bet it's been six or eight man months since I got to go down to all these, but I got those to last me. Now, these are not especially term healthy mama. If you're watching, my husband requested these. My husband, my son. My husband is primarily keto. I don't know if I've ever told you guys that. And low carb, but he does eat these every once in a while. So, these will last quite a while. They have 10 grams of protein and two net carbs. And I did have one on the way home because it had been four hours since we eat and I went ahead and ate one and they were very tasty I don't know how many I'll eat um, because I don't really know if they're on plan but it's better than going hungry and not eating skipping a meal so I went ahead and had one of those and I'm probably done I'll probably have an FP shake in just a little bit because I'm still a little bit hungry here are some non-food items we picked up at the we got this at Aldi I can't remember how much it was my husband put it in a buggy these um, krill oils were $3.99, $70. They're about 8 bucks at Walmart. This is some sample kind of variety thing my husband picked up at the discount store. I got these headphones at the Dollar Tree. I use those when I'm editing videos or watching TV on my Kindle late at night so I don't bother anybody. And they were a dollar at the Dollar Tree. Okay, my son and I are extremely stoked about these Washington Sweet Cherries. And I wish I could get them open if I can. Ugh, they're close. Anyway, I don't know if you guys can see them, but they are beautiful, guys. They're fat and plump and they're not rotten and they were, listen to this, $1.49. A bag. Not a pound, a bag. Which they are $3.99 and $4.99 right now. A pound here. This is just a little, this is almost two pounds, I think. A little pound and a half. So we are excited about that. We got that at the discount grocery store. As well as this watermelon, a seedless watermelon for two bucks. Yeah, they've been six and seven dollars, so we hadn't had one this year. Um, my son and husband are excited about that. Let's see, at Aldi's, I picked up some of my staples. I got an onion powder for $1.19. I got two garlic powders for $1.19 each. We use a bunch of those. I got an olive oil cooking spray at Aldi for $1.49. And I picked that up because... I bought this at the Dollar Tree thinking, hey, coconut oil. But I wrote, noticed on the back, and I won't even try and get this to focus, but it said soybean oil also. So I was disappointed. Also, I got this uh, pizza sauce at the Dollar Tree. It's not the best, but it'll work if I just use a tablespoon or so. Mild pecan sauce or salsa. I got the soy sauce. Now, I bought this at Aldi because I'm almost out of the Walmart brand. I didn't want to go to Walmart. It says it has mother in it, guys, but I can't see it. So, I'm a little bit disappointed. Hopefully, after it's been settled, I'll see the mother. But if you use this brand, let me know if you like it and if there's actually mother in it. It's $1.99. These are just a couple of um, individual pots of coffee I picked up. Decaf. Um, you don't really find the decaf uh, flavors, but they were $0.39 cents each at our discount store. These pickles, we love pickles, my son and I. They were, not going to focus, 79 cents a jar. I got a bag of brown rice at the discount grocery store. It's two pounds. That was for a dollar. Now, my son does eat this every once in a while. And um, it's not the best, I know, but he does eat it every once in a while. And these were for, let me see if I can get it to focus. Not going to. Anyway, a dollar a box. So I got those. I found this small bag of um, walnuts for 99 cents. They're $2.24 at my Walmart. This is going to go on my uh, Trimmy Thing Mama salad with the cottage cheese and the apples and celery. This guy's, oh, I think I showed you all these in the store. I was super excited. I had mayonnaise on my list, and this is $4 or $3.99 in our local, local grocery stores. I found the discount store had them for 99 cents on the focus no anyway you guys forgive me so i cleaned them out they, they had one more left but it didn't it had a broke lid i was scared about the seal they're perfectly fine they're all in date they don't go bad till february of next year so we have plenty of time to use them and i'm super excited another thing i'm excited about is this box of trivia it has 
80 packets and it was a dollar 99 you guys a dollar 99 super so this box right here seven dollars at our walmart another thing i'm excited about is a sweet leaf it's got 30 packets in it it is a dollar 99 this is also eight or nine dollars at our local kroger so that was a steal I got this. My husband and son drink coffee. Now, don't go crazy because son drinks mostly milk mixed with a little bit of coffee. But it always decaf. And I try and cut back on decaf. But every once in a while, I just need caffeine in the mornings. And so, I keep some around. So, I'm going to try this. This is instant, but it's Starbucks. Now, I normally do not drink instant coffee. But I'm praying this will be okay once in a while to take to work with me. Because they don't have a coffee pot. And, oh, Lord, help me gotta have coffee at that office uh, my husband picked out a green tea and this was at the um discount grocery 99 cents oh did i tell you this was at the discount grocery for a dollar 99 so and then they had these true lemon the 79 cent for these little this is peach lemonade i think that's a personal choice item and then they had these that are on plan true lemon and these were 79 cents for 32 just plain lemon packets Lastly, guys, we have some frozen vegetables. They had the baby Brussels sprouts at Aldi's for 99 cents per 12-ounce bag. So I got four of those. Then I was excited about these. They had extra fine green beans, and they were a 16-ounce um, bag. That's right, for $1.19. So I got four of those. We will have to have more vegetables, fresh vegetables later on. So that's why I am short of my budget. Or actually, I'm under budget, so I have extra money. So we'll use that to pick up some extra like ground beef later on and more veggies as we need on fresh veggies and stuff like that. I do have venison and pork a little bit left in the fridge. So this chicken is going to stock our fridge and we'll grab hamburger and stuff like that later. So I hope you've enjoyed this haul. I know it's kind of a long video. I'm sorry about that. But I hope you guys have a good night. Thanks for watching. Give me a thumbs up and share this video and I'll see you guys the next time.